Hey everybody, today I'm going to be talking to you about raspberry creamsicle from Crossroads Candles. This oh, just beautiful fragrance um, was the one that stood out to me the most out of the 10. Uh, it appealed to me the most, I should say. Um, you know, we all have our favorites and um, there are some that just win you over. Um, when you're trying a new brand and you're getting a bunch of fragrances as I did but that being said this is actually a 16 ounce two wick made with a paraffin blended wax with a burn time of 80 to 100 hours the notes are vine ripened raspberry vanilla cream and sugar very simple um, the appeal for me out of the box is a 10 and oddly enough the throw is a nine now they it didn't i didn't get much scent of, on cold like i really had to warm up that wax a little bit with my finger and sort of play around and then i was able to really get it but once i lit it up i actually saw on the top of the candle that kind of locked within the, the cold paraffin wax were these pools of scent oils around the wicks in the center. So I knew for sure it was gonna be a throw monster and, and sure enough it is. Um, so it's, it's seriously so good. I don't even know how to describe how good this is because it is a simple fragrance, you know? But, um, this is, uh, a sweet sort of raspberry dessert with like vanilla ice cream and whipped cream. Um, it reminds me of this raspberry cobbler dessert I used to get whenever we'd go out to eat when I was like 11 or 12 years old. Um, I'm, I'm really astonished by how authentic this presents because it is it, it you can you can get really plasticky when it comes to fragrances like this you know when whenever you're creating a scent whether it be for um a candle or 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 a body spray or something like that you can get this really inauthentic result with fragrances like this but this presents as very um real and true to what I would I would think a raspberry creamsicle tastes like you know um, and you get exactly what they say you're going to get like no more no less like you're getting that ripened raspberry you are getting vanilla you are getting cream and sugar um, the raspberry is more of a jam than straight like raspberry fruit um so you're not going to get any sourness from this at all it's um the, the the sweetness of the vanilla and the cream fit in fit this kind of into a dessert category but for those of you out there that like fruit fragrances but don't like bakery you don't have to worry because this is still in the fruit category and it is not a bakery so even though I said it smelled it, it kind of reminds me of the raspberry cobbler it doesn't have that baked good note in here it's really just straight raspberry vanilla cream you know it's not like raspberry vanilla um, body care from Bath and Body Works really I thought it might be like that and I love that fragrance so I wasn't I didn't mind but no this this really it's it's different it's different than that it's I would say it's um uh, th th that this one is more authentic than the black raspberry vanilla um, I like them both but I like this as a candle I really do I enjoy that this is so it's so real and you're getting exactly what it says you are like when a candle company does that 
it makes me believe them more and trust their company and their brand more. Um, I would say that the um, the flames, okay, uh, the, I didn't need to trim the, the wicks on this one uh, before my first um, burn. However, uh, the wicks are very large, but I don't mind it because... Um, they're not producing a crazy, like, you know, crazy soot or anything like that. Um, they were very bulbous and wide prior to me putting the camera on, but I'm not experiencing any issues. I'm not experiencing any soot. I'm not having any difficulty with the performance of this candle, which is also a really great thing. Now, keep in mind, this is my first burn and my first time ever burning a Crossroads candle. So I haven't experienced it fully down through. Um, and I hope to do that more and more um, with the candle, the next Crossroads that I review. I'd like to burn them three, four times and just check and see if the performance, diff, you know, um, changes through, you know, if it gets to the middle, does it change? Does it change in scent? Does it change... Um, does the, the, the wax change because the wicks are doing something weird, you know, which can tend to happen. So I like to report all of that, but I was really hyped about this fragrance so much so that I wanted to get this out. Um, I recommend this for anybody who enjoys raspberry fragrances, fruit fragrances, um, and just likes an overall just simple, sweet raspberry and cream kind of thing it's so so nice and i really don't see a lot of candle companies get, putting out a straight raspberry and this would come very close you know it isn't straight raspberry but it's very close to what i am look was looking for in a raspberry candle so um you know it's it, it, it's not uh at all like cupid's cocktail which is very raspberry based this is definitely the most authentic smelling. It smells like raspberry jam and like if you're familiar with um, something called clotted cream and it's amazing. Um, I had it in England a lot. It's like that. It's like a sweet raspberry jam and clotted cream just mixed together and it's great. It's wonderful and um, I... Yeah, I recommend that. So this has been my review of Raspberry Creamsicle from Crossroads Candles. I hope you're all having a wonderful day, and I will speak to you all soon. Bye! Thanks for watching. Please subscribe, like, and share with those you know who enjoy home fragrance as much as us. And hit the bell icon to be notified when I upload.